Hi guys, welcome to another Jarrow Vikings Insane Angling Adventure. Today I'm at Eyemouth once again, one of my favourite spots of course, uh, only up the road for me, so petrol wise, pretty cheap. So today it's going to be a day of two halves, I'm going to fish under the cannons at Eyemouth, which is a low water mark near the caravan site. You probably get about four hours fishing on there. I'm hoping for a nice pollock, wrasse, codlin, coalies. They're the normal uh, mainstay of, of that area. So I'll get a few of them, I'll be quite happy with that. And then once the tide starts to come in, I will get cut off if I don't move. So I'll be moving and I'll be coming over to the golf course side of Eyemouth and giving it a little go off here again for codlin and wrasse. Be doing some bait fishing, some spinning, and hopefully it works out quite well. Today I've got a lovely day for it. Again, it's a little bit grey and overcast at the minute, but uh, the sun's forecast to come out, which I think it's trying to now. So, yeah, it should be a good day anyway. I hope you enjoy this video. Go tight lines. I'll speak to you later once I've caught a few fish, hopefully. Well, first cast on the spinner looks like there's a few fish there. Little coalies by the look of it. Ah, uh, just a tiny little coalie.
Just another little coolie by the look of it. Yeah, definitely. There's a nice pullet, that's my first one that day. Ah, ah nice one. And the silver mineral spinner. Heard me first pollock of the day. It's a nice one. On the silver mineral spinner. We'll get him straight back. Come back. Oh god, yeah. Happy days. <laughs> Be happy days if it's a rass. I get to see Oh, I think it is. Yay. Happy days. 
You want to see the dance? <laughs> <laughs> so we just had a crack and bait there on the small rod on the ragworm and there's my second rass of the year a bit bigger this one well yeah happy days Just always do that, they look like they're dead. Uh -huh. And you put them back and give them a minute and they go. Right, right. Well, when I was fanning about with a drone, uh, I was up about 400 foot. My rod was going mental, so Andy, who was fishing nearby, picked my rod up. I said, I'll oh, just have a go, see if you can catch it, wherever it is. And uh, caught another fine wrasse there. So Andy's going to bring it over in a minute. We'll have a look at it. Whoop. Spiky mind. Spiky. <laughs> Oh yeah, she is. It's coming. Eventually. We're putting a we're putting a rock pool to keep it alive. There we go. You go right right up as close as you can, and there uh, you, you bend down and. There we go. Nice Ross. Ah, lovely that one. Ho half mine. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you it all. <laughs> Spot on. Happy hey, days.
cod on the spinner. Took some getting in that bugger. Lovely, lovely jubbly. I'll go and pump straight back. Hopefully I can get it in. Doesn't feel very big. Ah, it's a little cod then. Always good to see anyway. Tommy cod then. We'll certainly have a few more of them, I reckon. The fish on. Show sure what it is. Probably a coley or a codden. It's a fairly small one. Have we got? Oh, sandy! I haven't caught one of them for a while. Big sandy! <laughs> Mac, I got that one. I think uh, I might give it to the guy who's fishing next to us for bait. You want a big launch? Can he for beer? At the end of the day it was a good day out i really enjoyed today didn't catch tons of fish but uh, caught a couple of quality ones nice pollock a few codlin ras uh, always plenty of coalies up here so and the weather was great for once in scotland the sun shone and uh, it was really warm to be honest i had to put me uh, my cream on which you might have seen in the video <laughs> i have to put uh, factor 50 on just that's because I've got ginger skin to be honest <laughs> and uh, 
bit of a baldy head so anyway my head's okay my skin's okay uh, so I hope you've really enjoyed this video and check out the underwater footage where I put on that's new for me I hope you've enjoyed that and uh, say if you haven't subscribed already please do tell your friends about Jarrow Vikings Insane Angling Adventures and most of all go out there have some fun and catch a few fish tight lines oh yeah and I nearly forgot uh, I met three people today who uh, were out fishing who actually subscribed to the channel so it was great to meet Andy uh, the other two fellas I'm not too sure of the names but uh, they may reply on YouTube and uh, I'll say hello to them hopefully so like I say it was great to see you uh, lads and uh, Andy is going to be a, a YouTube, YouTube superstar catching the ras yeah, pinch me rod pinch me rod and pinch me ras <laughs> no, seriously I was really out of the moon for him to catch that ras it was great that's his first ever ass. So happy days. Again, tight lines.